Hello. Moo indeed. Hello peeps, Moobit here with another Filmic Fridays kind of thing and uh, yeah I'm actually not in Nottingham today, I'm, uh, I've travelled up north to uh, just the outskirts of Preston, this is the village of Kirkham here. So yeah we're up here for a job, which I can't talk about, uh, left the rest of the Team Reflector down in Sheffield today, just here on my own with my, my wife and daughter. She's from round here, so, you know, it helps. She's seen family. Hey horse, you seem to have escaped. But yeah, I'm just uh, having a little walk. Want to do a calibration flight on one of the drones. And a bit of a fun flight for me as well, with the uh, Mavic 2 Pro, the heavily modified one that I've got, that someone's put all the bells and whistles on, so yay. Just trying to find somewhere safe, because the problem with this area is there's a lot of airports nearby now there's a there's a massive gap where it's, it says it's safe to fly just just through here but obviously i've got to do a risk assessment of things before i go up in the air but i hope i can get a calibration flight done not as a calibration for the drones but for me because <laughs> you know unless you don't you've got to keep practicing you've got to keep keep your, your thumb skills nice and smooth you know this is a very bumpy path so hopefully the gimbal's taking all that out i really need a counterweight on the bottom of this I got thinking about family today, you know, your own family, your work family, you know, your community as a family, all that kind of a thing. It's uh, quite an apt little thing. And we're going to go into a tunnel. Are you ready? Ooh. Moo -ay! Moo -ay! That one's from my mother-in-law who told me to say moo -ay as I came through the tunnel. Don't know why, but there you go. I've now said moo -ay. Yeah, I've, uh, ooh. That's a handy fence. So yeah, I've been uh, thinking about that and how what we do to build build up families and networks uh, of, of people we like and trust. Um, like I've one just made a new friend today uh, through Facebook of all things. I know, young looking gentleman who works in the same industry as us. He makes short films just like Team Flight to do, and he's um, sold me a gimbal vest to take the edge off my um, my hands, and he's done me a really good deal because. You know, we're both in the same industry, we want to look out for each other. So big shout out to you. Um, I'm going to put, if he's got like links and things, I'm going to put them down here. So do go check out his stuff. But it was just a nice experience, you know. Um, people looking out for each other, having the same interests. You know, wanting to give back to the community, which is why I formed Movie at Media in the first place and why Team Reflector exists now. And if I'm distracted, because there's a big, there's a Kestrel just here like kind of circling and then hovering it's obviously looking it's obviously hunting for a mouse or something i haven't got a long enough lens to show you though i'm on a 24 at the moment it's going to look like a little tiny dot on your screen but it's quite majestic i was going to send the drone up in this field but i don't think i want to disturb that kestrel obviously so i'll uh, keep walking and find somewhere else you don't get this in uh, in your american vlogs hi bye bye we got uh I feel from the cows. They're not carving, so we're, we're relatively safe. So we're at the other side now. Pro tip when you're working with cows is uh, they, they're curious little buggers. Couldn't have said it better myself, mate. But yeah, if you have to walk through a field of cows to get somewhere, make sure they're not carving because uh, they can get a bit crazy. But uh, they seem all right today, don't you cows? You all right, aren't you girls? Hey, you being good girls? Good. I'm glad to hear it. Moo, Moo indeed. <laughs> right, let's go and find this uh, this other launch site, shall we?
up um, a footpath going through these, like a concreted footpath going through these woods. How bizarre. You see, I might have said this before um, on other vlogs, but I definitely have said it to uh, Team Reflector and all them lot. You know, family and a sense of community and a sense of... Tractor. <laughs> family, a sense of community is important, more important than ever, I think, this day and age. I mean, we don't need to look at social media. We're bombarded with negativity, with one-upmanship with uh, feelings that we need to compete with each other and we don't we really don't we can all grow together if we just look out out for each other and be kind to each other it's not hard and frankly if you're lazy like me it's easier because if you're just nice to people you don't have to remember all the shit that you've done and uh, you know why you dislike someone or something because my memory's going so it's just like i can't be bothered with that let's just be nice I thought it'd be a nice quiet spot, but there's um, an entrance to a farm just, just here, and uh, I'm getting nothing but tractors, so sorry about that. But yeah, me and Chris, um, who sold me the uh, you know gimbal vest thing, we got to talking and you know found out he was a short filmmaker as well. He knows Nick, uh, my business partner, Nick Hardy, and that's how they know each other. And that's it, we're a community. We all, if we all look out for each other, it's not like... I found like working with photographers in the past, they're either kind of cool like Nick and Dean are, or they're complete opposite. They're like everyone's your competition and they, they want to screw you over. And I've met some that have spread lies about myself or one, one of my colleagues or anything, just so they look better on Facebook and things. And it's just like, what? You just be, you, no. Because if you're just nice, like he was, and like I was to him, He's now got work for us because we, we're about to do a shoot and we need a couple extra crew members. There you go. If you're just nice and polite and get talking to people and show that you're an alright, okay guy to hang around, you will get work, especially in the film industry. Nobody has time for dramas and people being a dick to each other or he said, she said and all that. No, you haven't got time. Time is money in films. So if, if you're spending time arguing with people, that's money you're wasting that's the client's money and you will not get called back. It's, it's as simple as that. Whereas if you're just nice and get on with it and, and look out for each other, and if you're stuck, you know, if you're stuck for something to do because you've done all your tasks, you, you ask for if someone else wants to help, they'll either say yes, brilliant, or you know, they'll say no because you're supposed to stay in your lane and some people like that, that's fine, that's nothing personal. But it's when people start doing the whole office drama bullshit, and that's something I didn't like back when I did work in an office. I mean, I was um, a pharmacy technician for a while. That was kind of bitchy uh, amongst all the men, especially, <laughs> weirdly. Um, and um, then worked in an office. And again, there's a lot of this office drama, blah, blah, blah. It's cause, I think it's because you got like a boring job and there's nothing that's better to do. And it's a real breath of fresh air to go properly full time into photography and filmmaking, to be honest, because people are just nice. And if they're not nice, they're gone. Suits me fine. So yeah, don't don't see other people as competitions or fear, fear with the unknown. Get to know people. Have a chat. Do that old fashioned thing and show some interest. You might find you actually make some new friends along the way. into a field of cows, it seems. Oh. <laughs> Hashtag vlog life. You see? Try again. 
Right, so you don't get this in your uh, American and Canadian vlogs, do you? Fields of cows, which is uh, pretty normal over here in Blighty. Hello. But let me just get you a better view, peeps. Let me get you a better view. There we go. Oh, these are beautiful cows. Look at them, proper bovine looking things. What are they called? Frisians, I think. Hi. Hello. How are you? Are you my friend? Oh, hey up. We've got some more. Hi. Hello. Hello. I don't have any food for you. You know, family and a sense of community and a sense of Tractor. <laughs>